Okay, hey everyone, and welcome to another Class 66 Rocks Stobart review. Now, in this review, um, I'm going to be taking a look at an, at an Atlas Editions model, but unfortunately, I can't actually find the certificate for authenticity. Um, as I've been turning the house upside down trying to find it um, this morning. But I've had no luck finding it, so I will just have to show you the model in this review, I'm afraid. So I apologise for that. So let's get on with the review then. So, as we can see here, it is a Scania R143 um, 420 Kurt inside. It's called Emily Kim and has the fleet registration number H156. So as we can tell by looking at the box it's in the Eddie Stobart Limited Express Road Haulage Specialist Colours. We can see here if we turn it around again it's a Scania. It's in 176th scale and it's a special edition collector's model. Now if we just take a look at the back we can see it is by Atlas Editions and it's actually produced by Oxford Diecast. So, now you know that Oxen make them for Atlas. Right, so, before I open the box, I'd also just like to say that this particular truck is absolutely outstanding. Um, and also, I know it's not much important to some of you, but my dad actually used to drive one of these Scania's. Um, not Stobart's, he didn't work for them. Um, but a company I used to work for, um, it was one of the trucks that I didn't actually get to go in. So it's quite nice that we've got a model of the same truck. So with that out of the way, let's open the box and have a look at it. So we'll just discard the box and the piece of plastic. And here it is, the Scania R143M 420. Now, first off, I've got to say there's not much weight to this, so it's quite a lightweight truck. So, as we can see, it is presented on a very nice display stand. And here we can see it says Scania R143M 420 Kurt inside, Emily Kim, and fleet number H156. So, let's start with the front of the truck then, shall we? So, moving the cab close to the camcorder, we can see across the top of the foil here, we've got Stobart in black and gold writing. Moving down now, we've got a black visor. I'm not too sure whether that's a sun visor or just a normal visor. As we can see, we've got the mirrors on the left and the right hand side here, as well as the blind spot mirror which is obviously all round here and there's a little mirror the other side as well. Now as you can see there, you can probably just about see the name Emily Kim, but it's that small, I don't think the camcorder could pick it up. But you've got the Stobart Arrow designs on the left and the right hand side here. And the S's are in like a gold colour with a red backdrop. And we've also got the Scania badge in the middle there. So moving down to the grille section here, on the green we can see it says Express Haulage and if I just try and zoom it in, but it's not really working, but I can obviously see it with my eyes but I think the camcorder might just be picking that up. So now we can see just below that we've got the indicators if you can just about see them on the left and right hand side. We've got the headlights here and there the words on 43M and 420 and on the bottom here we've got two lamps whether or not they're fogs or spots and the number plate is N156XAO so now let's turn the truck around to the side as we can see it's a four wheel trapped unit so moving in closer now we can see we've got the Stobart flag design just there We've got the very nice Stobart arrow design in gold. Now the majority of this is actually on the green area of the side of the cab this time. As before some of it was on the white as well. And here we can see we have the fleet number H156. 
So, moving along to the trailer now, we can see it's a triaxle trailer, and on the top of the trailer here, uh, excuse me, we've got the Stobart arrows with two S's on them. So, moving along now, we can see we've also got some very very detailed curtain straps running all the way down the side of the trailer and it's the same the other side and um, these are obviously painted in black now some are actually painted in silver so there's two different colors that i think oxford diecast use on these atlas editions models so as we can see here we've got the stunning eddie stobart wording in gold with a red shadow effect on the back and the words Express Road Hall is Specialist underneath in white. So now we'll turn the truck around. And as we can see on the back here, we've got Eddie Stobart Limited again with the gold writing with a red shadow effect backdrop on. Moving down, we've got Express Haulage in black and gold on a white border. We've also got the type of trailer, or the trailer number should I say, um, I think it might be trailer number with this model, which is T424, and then again the number plate, N156XAO. We've got brakes in indicators on the left and the right hand side there, and we've also got a red and white striped bumper at the back of the trailer. So moving the truck around now to the other side, we can see it's exactly the same. There's not anything any different. We've got the Stobart wording, which is absolutely outstanding. Um, I absolutely love the design of these, um, and you can't fault them. And they're really good value for money as well. Um, obviously, if you've collected the series, you'll know what I'm on about. Um, but if you haven't, then it might be worth looking on the Stobart group website. If you're in the fan club like myself and um, where well you can actually pick up some of these models anyway um, after they come out by Oxford diecast and Atlas so like I say there's nothing much different on this side and um, the cab is exactly the same we've got the Stobar tarot design there and um, the flags there fleet number so there's nothing really much I can say for the other side of the model but that's it basically the Scania R143M 420 curtain side Emily Kim H156 in Eddie Stobart livery